Patrick Baker. I'm the Hitachi Mid and Large Size Excavator Product Manager. We're at the beautiful outdoor festival lot at the Hitachi Outdoor Booth. We're looking at our all new ZX345 USLC-7. So this is our all new Dash 7 series. You're gonna find that across all 13 of our mid and large size excavators. So we're gonna take a quick look at our undercarriage and talk about some of the updates and advancements with this Dash 7 undercarriage compared to our previous generation. So taking care of this undercarriage, creating a really stable base, especially for an ultra short tail swing is critical to the performance and productivity of the machine. So what we've done is we've gone to great lengths, a lot of innovation and in, in engineering went into updating this undercarriage. We've strengthened the X-beam, giving it a more rigid uh, structural base um, for the upper structure. You're gonna find that components such as the idler, the roller, our drive motor have all been strengthened. Our seals are very high quality. Um, we use the best components in the industry with that added strength and uh, reliability the operator and owners are not gonna to have to worry as much about the undercarriage giving them fits on a maintenance and service side. We even slope the undercarriage track frame, trying to show that um, during mud compaction, that even when tracking, that uh, that mud will not be so compacted and, and help the operator uh, protect those seals and protect that undercarriage from uh, any damage due to the mud compaction. We did update from one track guard to three track guards on the Dash 7s as well on this 345. And again, the drive motor has also been improved, helping with fuel efficiency and track effectiveness um, when operating or tracking on relatively flat ground. So on the ZX345 US LC-7, what really separates the Hitachi product is our three pump hydraulic system. We call this the Trius 2 system. So we have two dedicated hydraulic pumps that operate the boom, arm, and bucket with a third pump that can supply direct flow to your track and swing, but can also be redirected for tuning the arm, bucket, and swing. So the effectiveness, you're gonna save a lot on fuel efficiency, uh, operating in one of our three operating modes, either eco, power, or high power. Uh, all three of those modes with the new three pump system will allow operators and owners to save anywhere between two to 10% in fuel costs, depending on the mode. Um, you're also gonna find additional performance and productivity benefits at the front end with added breakout force and better production. So we're inside of the ZX345 USLC-7 cab. First and foremost, the cab has been enlarged by over three inches of length. You can see I'm 5'10", I have tons of space. We've added leg room. One of the really great features of the new cab is this dual adjustable seat and console. The seat goes forward and backwards, and you can also raise and lower the seat. So what's great about this is the joysticks will raise and lower with the position. So operators aren't down here or way up here with their joysticks, they can find that perfect position to keep them productive in the cab. We have a new eight inch LCD monitor and display with Bluetooth. There's a lot of customization for operators from setting 16 different preset attachments, fine tuning your arm, bucket, or uh, swing power with the hydraulic system. You can also set any pressures or flow rates through the cab uh, display, as well as setting service and maintenance schedules, and again, the addition of Bluetooth keeps operators hands free. It's pretty difficult to uh, operate with just one hand with that cell phone in your ear. We've redesigned our console of switches and brought them a little bit back into the cab. On the Dash 6, they actually were a straight line. And what we've done is we've actually cut out this dip so you have great visibility of your right hand side for added safety and better production there. Last but not least, we've updated our wiper. So from the 20 ton all the way up to our 890 ton, we have a double wiper for both the top glass and the bottom glass, giving us almost 95% coverage of our windshield. Mm -hmm. 